Asan Heart Institute held the first Tavis Summit, an international conference on transcatheter aortic valve implantation on September 3rd. Co-sponsored by the Cardiovascular Research Foundation, it was held at the Sheraton Grand Walkwell Hotel in Seoul. The first meeting of its kind in the Asia-Pacific region, the summit introduced the latest techniques and clinical expertise in the treatment of aortic stenosis. Especially well received by the 400 attendees was a live demonstration by Dr. Elaine Cribier of Charles Nicole Hospital in France, a well-known expert in the TAVI field, and by the team of Dr. Sung Jung Park, which has drawn on attention from the international medical community for its work on the effects of using stent on left main coronary artery liaisons. Surgical techniques shown in the live case demonstrations included the transfemoral TAVI approach, in which an artificial valve is guided to the main artery through a catheter, inserted into the femoral artery in the thigh. A transapical approach was also demonstrated involving inserting a catheter and guiding the artificial valve directly into the cardiac apex. Dr. Sung Jung Park, who led the conference, expressed his hope that through this summit, TAVI would take its place as a successful treatment option in Korea and also in the Asia-Pacific region. He also noted that the summit continues it will be developed towards the customized treatments for people in the Asia-Pacific region. Unlike conventional valve replacement procedures that requires major open-heart surgery with a large chest incision, the TAVI method involves guiding a balloon to the narrow valve through the femoral artery, positioning and inflating the balloon to dilate the valve, and then anchoring the stent in place. Korea's first successful stent procedure for aortic stenosis was performed by Dr. Park's team.